What's up guys? Welcome to Trident Marine Chronicles episode one. That's Joel. That's Nicole. I'm Joe. And this is, well, I told you, Trident Marine Chronicles. So I've ate it five times, but it's so lovely. That's good. It's Joel just started eating meat again. <laughs> but we've got more important things to do. We've got a fish order on box. So today at Triton Marine, we have 10 boxes of fish that came in, which is, I think, you said it was a total of 62 fish. Uh, definitely one of the biggest shipments I've ever unboxed here. Um, probably one of the biggest, you know, around the biggest size that we ever get in at the same time. I haven't looked at the invoice or anything, what we're getting, so it's gonna be interesting to see what we actually do get in these uh, boxes. All right, so since it's winter, uh, we always get them sent to us with uh, you know heat packs just to keep the fish warm. These just go directly in the trash. Underneath them is all of the fish. Now, along with fish in these shipments, we do get, of course, coral. This is a this is a toadstool leather. It's in a bunch of bags in there just to keep it uh, in the water, so you can't really tell. But the first step that we do is we will search through all of the boxes and we'll separate out the corals and put them in big gray tubs like this. Uh, to wait so that we can acclimate them to our systems and dip them before we put them in our regular systems. That way they don't bring in any uh, sort of diseases or pests uh, into the system. It's just the safest way to go so that we can continue to have healthy coral in all of our tanks and sell healthy coral. Tiny hermits, cleaner shrimp, assorted inverts, serith snails, and all the corals, well, not much, but we got new corals in as well. So that's all of the inverts and coral. And that's Nicole. Now what I've got to do is get all of these fish out into the front in those tanks you can see through the 500 and put them all in tanks that they're going to do well in with tank mates that they're going to do well with. And there's a there's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I'm filming you, right now. What are you doing? Will you teach me how to put the fish into the tanks because I don't know how Yeah. Happen. Yeah, it's kind of something you learn over time cuz I I've never actually like listened to you go through your methods so can I like Yeah. Of yeah, I'll show you. Apparently, I'm teaching my assistant, Nicole, how to do it too. So you guys are gonna get a wonderful tutorial. So far, I know that we have three sailfin blennies, algae blennies. So these, Nicole, go over here. Nicole! Nicole! I'm trying to teach you. You told me to teach you. And then when I tell you that we're going to do it, you don't follow me. Self and algae blennies, we've been putting in these. Uh, this guy is going to need to go in one of the fish tanks. So they can't be together? No, you don't want to put them together. Yeah. Nicole, copper band butterfly. <laughs> She's been working here how long, Joel? <laughs> it eats Aptasia. The stuff that you suck at killing. <laughs> this thing is in four bags. Look at the size of that trigger fish. Just to give like, that's like the size of my hand, easily, at least. Can't really give good size comparison at this point until we get him in a tank, but he's huge. and. We might have another one. I don't know. This might be a different one, but we've got two massive fish here. Now you can see the size a little bit better once we got them in some fresh water. It's a big black Indian trigger. And the other one is a queen trigger, about the same size as the black Indian. Very pretty fish. This is what the aftermath of a fish order looks like. A lot of empty boxes that we have to break down and throw in the dumpster, which is a ton of fun. 
But that's uh, that's pretty much gonna do it for for the video. Uh, I'm gonna shoot more B-roll because I haven't done that yet. I gotta get the uh, fish once they're actually into the tank. But after that, I mean, it's pretty good. Dread Marine Chronicles Episode 1 has come to a close. If you enjoyed it, please remember to leave a like below and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you all so much for watching this video, and we will see you later.